Shields up, Iron Breakers. How's everybody doing this fine Saturday afternoon? Hopefully, you are doing better than our poor bucket man who had a terrible fate at the end of the last stream. He effectively died. He died for our sins because we crashed and we lost our save file. It got corrupted. I'll show you guys in I'll show you guys in a couple of seconds here. Uh, yeah, that was uh, a strange one, but that's, I feel like, one of the consequences of early access. The team is still very much hard at work uh, in the game, as it seems. To give you guys an idea, since we did the live stream yesterday, they have deployed two new patches into the current version of the game that we are playing. So, hey, they're patching it up. Hopefully, things will be a little bit more stable for release, including... For people that are using the uh, AMD GPUs, we shall see if that is the case or not. For those of you that are not aware, I did get a code from uh, CI Games for early access to Lords of the Fallen. And I'm basically going to be replaying some of the stuff that you might have seen yesterday already because, you know, I don't have a character ready for the 12th when the rest of the embargo lifts. So we need to have a character ready to continue playing by then. But today we'll probably take it easy. I'm not sure if I'm going to be, you know, going as hard as I went yesterday. It's going to chill. Take it a little bit more chill. And we'll see. This time use the face altering thing. No, they fixed that. That was one of the things that they fixed, which is why I'm, you know, it's another reason why I should check out making a new character so that you guys can actually see the way that it is intended to work. Because, yeah, they, they actually fixed that stuff. After eons of tyranny, the demon god Adir was finally overthrown by humanity. Though fear of his terrible power endured. And so was formed the hallowed sentinels. Our duty being to stand vigil for signs of his return. Even exile to another realm could not silence the fallen god forever. And in time, Adir's malignant influence pervaded the world once more. In his hunger for vengeance, Adir orchestrated the return of his demonic army. Light was swallowed by shadow, and with it, hope. A new, grim champion arises, the Dark Crusader. And perhaps it will indeed come to pass that only they who shun the light in order to fight the darkness possess the power to defy a god. Gave him the chop. He probably had a parasite. He probably had a parasite, and the dude didn't clean the parasite before, and that's why he got rocked. Honda. You have to say it with an aggressive tone of voice, otherwise it doesn't work. Yes, we're doing lantern only run. Don't even worry about it. It's completely guaranteed. Not a problem. Uh, oh right, I I could have sh I, I should show you guys before we before we do this. Let me actually show you guys something. Like check this out. <laughs> there he is. There's our boy. His name is now Corrupted Save. 
Bucket Man was too powerful for this world, and therefore he was removed from it in the form of a corrupted save. You guys might have thought I was joking. It's right there. <laughs> All right. So this time we're not going to be playing Bucket Man. I know. I know. You guys are disappointed. I'm sorry. It's not happening. In a conflict between the divine are mortals mere pawns? Whether the flesh of gods or death itself, all will be consumed. The Jeek Bucket Man was legit, man. For she must be. Pizza Man invaded. Thank you very much for making five people grossly incandescent. Tip of the hat. That's one, two, three, four, five. Thank you. Appreciate the support, sir. Oh, I just realized. You're grossly incandescent. You guys can't actually hear that. Boris, forgive me. I'd steer this weapon of deliverance to a worthier servant than I. Yeet! I love how he's got like one of the most powerful weapons ever, and he's just like. You were not worthy of the you lantern. Never possessed the metal for this crusader. You. Here we go. So I'm going to try to go get through this real quick. Uh, just letting you guys know we're going to be playing this. More instead infantry. I like this dude. This dude in the cover. I like him. And that's what we're going to be playing. It was either that or the Black Feather Ranger. I do want to play an agility character. But I want to play one with a spear. So we're going to go for Spear Boy this time around. Uh, see, they've actually changed the way that the, the head stuff works. We can actually use it properly now. We're gonna go for this, this, and that. That'll do. See, you can actually see the head change properly, although skin color is a little bit on the dark side for me. We're gonna go for this. Wait, no, this one. This. So you can actually see the face change depending on where you place the thing. This is how it was supposed to work yesterday, but the patch that they had done messed up the game a little bit. Mm, let me see what we're shooting for. I think I might actually go for... Even though this one kind of feels like... I don't know, this one feels like it's got more detail, so we'll do this. Now we have to once again do the hair that we usually do. What the hell happened? Do, 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 do. And we actually have more options on the character creator now. Like, you have the, the highlights, which you didn't have last time. Although for some reason it doesn't work too well on controller input. So we'll do that. Uh, we still need to choose the haircut though. We're gonna go for this. 
kind of elvish almost a little bit, but not too much. All right, it's acceptable. Facial hair, we're gonna go for, I think it's this one, right? Yeah, this one. Copy hair color, perfect. That's exactly what we're looking for. Uh, we don't really do tattoos. I'm just getting rid of some of the tattoos they put in our face. This looks decent. Uh, now we go body. Body is like thick and muscular, okay? An even split of thickness and muscle. Let's go, f not even split, let's go a little bit more muscle. Yeah, like, uh... That, that works. Uh, I do want some tattoos in here. Which ones are the ones that I was using? I think I had one like the back. <clears throat> Intensity. Yeah, we're gonna go for this here. No, 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 I remember what I had. Okay, because I was messing around with the character creator earlier this morning, yeah. We're gonna go for some scars on the chest. These look perfect, because it looks like wounds, basically. On the back, oh, I still have to change the eyes. I think that's on the head. On the back, we're gonna do this uh, shield-looking thing. Maximum intensity. Left arm, that's our shield arm. That one got pretty badly mangled. It's our shield arm, so you know, it gets hurt a little bit more. And in the right arm, we go for this, yes. Maximum intensity. Nothing on legs. All right, we have to do face texture. That's what I was forgetting. Yeah, middle-aged. Old man. Old man Rurikon. It's really hard to make, like, cool-looking eyes, in my opinion. I mean, not cool-looking, but, like, accurate-looking eyes. That'll do. Ah, uh, we're gonna go for these. On the nose side, which one was I using? On a bit of a thicker nose. Ah, uh, eight will do. That's the mouth, and we want thicker cheekbones, proper dwarven-like. We're probably gonna go with three over here. Yeah, three looks best. Okay, that's done. Body's done. There it is. There's our boy.
The BoomerCon final form. Yes, dude. Yes, indeed. Law, the latest receiver of his grace. I want to get that sweet looking hat this guy's got. Great potential dwells within you, doubtless, for you to be chosen thusly. And so does Aureus wisdom guide my hand in the bestowment of this subsequent boon. I love how he just like meets us, gives us the boon, then abandons us to our luck. Been made sacrosanct with the mark of the Dark Crusaders. Prove yourself worthy of this gift. Seek me in the bowels of the bridge. Sure thing, brother. Our work is of the greatest import. No, we're not doing Bucket Boy again. We are with the Mornstead Infantry. Mornstead Infantry. The game was patched twice. We shall see how better the performance is. Although one of the things I definitely need is more brightness. Should have messed with it. Right now it's running at 120, which is not too bad. Uh, I did lower some of the settings. We're not using FSR. I don't like FSR. Uh, let me just calibrate screen here. We need way more brightness, my guy. Take it up to 70. Maybe that'll do. That's better. It might be a little bit too bright on stream, but otherwise I can't see Jack. Oh wow, the performance is much better than last time I was here. Cool beans. So, one of you guys said if you turn off camera shake... Where is camera shake even? Is that in gameplay? Camera shake. What if you guys were saying that without camera shake it actually feels better? That might be a wise decision, so we'll go with without camera shake. Can you stream the whole game? No. Uh, there's a embargo on going past uh, the Congregator of Flesh, which was the last boss that we did yesterday. That's as much as we get to stream for now. Brother. Ow. Just trying to practice my parries. There's the guy. Frames are holding up much better than yesterday. So one of the things that I didn't do yesterday is actually drop down here. Because there's actually an item down here, which I think is like a cosmetic thing. A tincture. But I think this supposedly changes the colors of your armor. So like if we look here, we got like blue, green, blue. Let me see what happens if we actually equip this. That didn't really do much. Does it do anything at all? I don't think it's doing anything. <laughs> like, you can see the thing. I don't know, it says... Tincture. I'm assuming this is some kind of, like, uh... Cosmetic thing? But... Oh, maybe it's just applying it to the helmet? Ah! Dumbass! Rurikon's a dumbass! Yeah, that does it. Oh, I like that. Yeah, let's go all the way. Oh, that is nice. I hadn't noticed that. That's pretty cool. That's pretty legit. Whee! Hello, brother. 
I gotta run away. I like that move a lot. The running R2 on the on the spear, I like it a lot. It's a cool animation. Ooh, frames are dropping. Uh-oh. Bonk. No, sir. No, sir. Pick that up. a wooden cross. We're not going to be needing the wooden cross today, my guy. Because today we actually have a spear. Are you running? The game is still incredibly dark in some areas. What are you doing? Thought about it. Out of the way, malevolent scum. All right. Whoops. Almost looks like a side room. Did we ever go there? We might have. Dude, the baby screaming like it's like, bro. I'm a parent. Give me PTSD, man. You put a baby screaming in a game, it's a good way to give me PTSD. No, 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 no. My save file was corrupted before the, the game was patched. It has nothing to do with the patches. Oops. Whoa, that was sneaky as fuck. See how sneaky that was? <laughs> Got him with the parry right there. Again. That's what's up. We've been we've been practicing them parries. Still not perfect, but better than I was yesterday. You get the hell out of here. Get out. Nobody likes you. Well, what? You guys want some? Huh? Bro, get rocked. Having an actual weapon feels good, man. Enervated Vigor Skull. Is the parry better than Lies of P? Uh, I would say it's a little bit more forgiving, yes. Still very similar though, because like, you still get... Well, depends. Because like, on Lies of P, you don't lose health when you perfect parry. In this game, you do. You get withered health even if you're perfect parry. Which I think I'm, I'm not sure if that's the way that it should be, but that's the choice the developers made. Back to Axiom!
All right. Itch. I make the rules. Let's go. What are your thoughts about the game? Comparable to Lies of P is the most recent Soulsborne out there. I mean, it's very different from Lies of P, and it feels very different from Lies of P. It depends on the type of player you are. I feel like there's a bit more floatiness to the movement and the combat in here than in Lies of P. But, you know, some people are into that. What I do like is exploring the levels. I think the levels in this game, so far, are cooler than the levels in Lies of P. And I like the setting more as well. So, there's that. Wait, didn't I rest? All my potions, goddammit. Comparable to Elden Ring? No. But very few things are going to be comparable to Elden Ring. Sit down, son. Give me that lamp. No. I'm not gonna do that. This is your script to death. Even though, I wonder if you can actually beat it. I would assume you can. But it's gonna be reasonably tough. Really, bruv? And do me dirty like that? You get your filthy Rogar hands off of me! Oh, it's the Iron Wanderer. Bro, I summoned him earlier today just to see what it was like. He's got a hammer. I'm talking like a beast hammer, okay? That guy's got a hammer that could solve so many problems. You have no idea. My souls. Hey, were you gonna try Dark Crusader class on release? No. I already tried Dark Crusader. I don't think he's that special. Is he the special class, Dark Crusader? I guess I understand why he would be. He's got like the heaviest armor, I think. He's like one of the easier classes to play. I would imagine. Don't actually know. I haven't tested it properly. 
Iron Wander. For some reason, everything looks like a nail. Yeah, dude. Iron Wander does not mess around. I don't like the way this thing works. You can't actually be locked onto your target for it to work properly. Wayfair. Others. You're probably thinking that lamp's just a tool to be used as you see fit. Take it lightly, and you'll find it's the other way around. Mark my words. I don't know who you are, and I don't care. But since Aww. it seems a deer has you marked, make but I a like you. threat to the rogue ourselves as both. I've defied the wills of gods and kings. If you know any kind of freedom, you'll do the same. I've defied. If you know okay. any kind. This did you handle all. Uh, we don't need to rest because I'm gonna have to go back into Umbral right here. Because of this. Sentinels! To the crypt! Fall back! Fall, Fall back! back! No! Wait! Where are you going? Help us! Well, I guess y'all didn't make it. Hey, hey, hey! Whoa, 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 whoa! Bro, little bro. God fucking damn it. Look at what you did. Get out of here. Skedaddle. Isn't that a thing you guys say? Go on now. Skedaddle. Beep. Fire ward. And now, and now. Point. Oh wow, that's a nice attack. I hadn't done that one yet. Look at that. Look, 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 look. Pop. Bro, that's beautiful. That's a work of art. I like that. I like that a lot. Let's go ahead and come back. Back into Axiom, the world of the living. Eh, eh, eh. Sup, 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 sup. Damn it. Why didn't you commit? Commit, goddamn you! Bastard! Okay, little bro. That's what you get. That's what you get. Uh, was there anything back here? I haven't been here since yesterday. Uh, oh wait, there's a dude back here. Get him! The mother. That was dirty. I know you're in there. Hey, yo. Whoa! I didn't see the one on the side.
not appreciate that. God damn. I wish this spear was a little bit faster. Anyway, we need to take care of him now. <laughs> Yeet! That's what you get. That dude's got a parasite too. <laughs> Him. There's also a chest here which has a sword. Yoink. Wait, isn't this part two? No, this is part one because we lost the save from yesterday. Frame generation still grayed out in the new patches. There isn't even a, an option now. Got uh, FSR quality, sharpness, that's it. That's most of the things from here. Except now there's a really tough dude on the other side of that house. It's very annoying. Let's see if I can bait him. Hey, bro. Now listen, just let me run away, okay? It's all good. Look how mad he gets, like, instantly fires up. Are you changing your mind? I missed. That guy's kind of annoying. He can mess us up if I'm not careful. doesn't come all the way here. That's... Damn, he still hit me. <laughs> This is not gonna go our way.
Good spar. You can go ahead and die now. That took a while to die. Proselyte legging. Is that a weapon? Huh. You get a medium leg. Just one. <laughs> Is that even better than what we got? Uh, a little bit. Does this game have seamless co-op? Uh, according to the developers, yes. I didn't really get to test that yet. So here's something that I didn't do yesterday. I've been exploring this zone a little bit to test some stuff out. Oh, I'm out of ranged weapons? That sucks. I don't know how I'm supposed to get that now. How would I be able to get that without a ranged weapon? Oh well. Maybe one of these dudes will give me one. Bomb angler axe, burn resistant bomb. Really? Come on, just a little bit of ranged ammunition? Oof. Things are not looking good for us, team, because I wanted to get that item. I don't even know what the item is, I just kind of want to get it. I don't think we have a, an overhead slam. I mean, I have this move. I doubt it'll hit that, but I can try. Is this game more frustrating or fun? Depends on your skill level. Nope. Maybe the sword, because we do have like a sword. No, I can't hit that thing. I see you picked the real class this time. Dude, our class was not the problem. I was doing fine with the class that I had. The problem was that the f we lost our save. <sighs> Bucket Man is a fantastic class. But it's only for the skilled players, you know? It's not for everybody. Oh man, I'm not going to be able to get that. Dude, this thing should almost reach it. Like, look. Ah! Nice. See, I don't even want that. A two hander on this? Oof. Rip. Lost it, eh? Hey, Coffee, Wh Coffee Wheeler, you're welcome to rewind the stream a little bit. Because I still have the corrupted save file. Pokey boy is a beast. Uh, I think I'm gonna beeline for the um, next thing. Wait, is he our vengeance target? He is. Dasha! I'll avenge you, Dasha! Oh! Get him! Oh, damn. Bro's got some health. Oh, you prick. Dasha, you have been avenged. 
We now have three plucked eyeballs. I believe there's not. Yep. Unripe berries. So green berries, because they're not ripe yet. He went in with a hex editor and messed it up. Yes, that's exactly what I did because I felt like replaying the first seven hours of the game all over again with a different class, despite the fact that I already had access to everything so this class has. <laughs> Dina Mercad, thank you very much for becoming grossly incandescent. Tip of the hat. And Fred does Vox. Thank you very much for the souls. Tip of the hat. Appreciate the support. Thank you. Is this more forgiving than the souls games? Um... In some aspects, yes. In some aspects, no. So, like, I feel like your stamina is a little bit more restricted. Kinda. Um, but your rolls are, like, ridiculous. Like, look at these rolls. Bro, I will roll to a different zip code. So the rolls are very forgiving. Uh, but yeah, it depends on what you're talking about. Blocking is less forgiving. So, it's one of those things. Hold up, you spent sa seven hours reaching Congregator? I spent seven hours beating Congregator. <clears throat> but yes, I did. I did, cowboy. Trust me, Bucket Boy is not easy. But the main problem, cowboy, is the performance. Because, like, when you're trying to do perfect dodges, and your frame rate goes from, like, 80 to 30, it kind of fucks with your timings quite a bit. And a lot of bosses, so yeah. Losing your skills in the age, old man. Hey, you, you'll you get there too, buddy. Don't you worry. You'll get there too. <laughs> <laughs> so let me see. We'll put some more vitality. Oh, we get to put like one point. Great. Although we're kind of close to leveling up. Uh, there's weapons with physics, G-Red. Uh, yesterday I picked up a flail. That thing had physics. You could spin it around and you'd see it. <laughs> so here's something that I also didn't do yesterday. That was a little bit risky. Baby noises, dude. They need to cut that shit off. Triggers my P PTSD real bad. Umbral Scouring. I'm not exactly sure what Umbral Scouring is for. And I need to look at that item that we just picked up. Because I don't actually know what that is for either. By the way, team, do remember if you're enjoying the live stream, you can hit that like button. It really helps us out. Let's go ahead. And also, you can subscribe, bell notification icon, all of these good things. 
We're gonna take Vitality all the way up to 15. And then I'm gonna take Agility to 15. <clears throat> and then maybe Endurance to 15, we'll see. <clears throat> but the most important thing right now is Vitality. Wait, why am I still here? Just to suffer? Oh man, you guys are gonna start charging me for the winks? I'm gonna start saying Onicha. If you're gonna be like that, I'm gonna be like, Onicha! Thank you for 100 likes! You like, you like that shit? <laughs> there you go. You get, you get the Onicha! Like, right up in there. <clears throat> ara, ara! Can I do it again? Yes, I can. Bro, I'm just chilling, exploring the game. Why you gotta be an ass? Huh? I love how they just explode. Like, he drops his axes and just gets, gets them yeeted. Yeetus, the leetus! You think this game will run on my Steam Deck, good sir? I have no idea. I don't own a Steam Deck. People ask me about the Steam Deck all the time. I'm a, I, I'll, I'll just do like a, a GoFundMe to get a Steam Deck. How about that? <laughs> YouTube doesn't pay me enough to buy a Steam Deck. Do you think the dual world mechanic is good? It's really awesome, but you always have to check both worlds everywhere you go and murder could bit, get a bit annoying. It's like, you don't always have to check. You might miss on some things. Like, I missed on a couple of things because I didn't check. But you don't have to check it all the time. It's not the end of the world. Look at him. Wait, there's a beefy boy coming. It's about to get crowded in here. And they usually do a good job of letting you know when you're supposed to change worlds. I think the, the world changing mechanic is actually very well implemented, personally. I think they've done a fairly good job with that. Like, there are th some things I'm not fully sold on, like the um, how floaty some of the movement and combat feels. I'm not super sold on that just yet. But, like, the actual implementation of the Umbral and Axiom world, I think that so far has been really good. It's actually one of the highlights. Do you prefer YouTube streaming over Twitch? Yes, I do. Oh, right, I don't have to go through here. Oh, hello. You bastard. I'm leaving. Shortcut. Not that that shortcut matters, because we're about to get a uh, checkpoint. How's it doing on PC performance? Is still not fantastic? Because it's too wobbly, that's the problem. Because, like, we're constantly above 60, but it goes like 90, 70, 60, 80, 90, set. Like, right now we're at 85. 
if I go back to where we were, I can see right now we're 85. Then if I go over here, now we're at 76. Now we're at 60. Now we're at 75. It's like, eh. The thing is, from what I hear, this is mostly an AMD thing. Like, Cowboy doesn't have problems with this on his NVIDIA. So, I, I don't know. Then again, Cowboy's rig is like giga beast, so... All right, he has to give me the vest. If you don't want to keep retreading the same ground yourself, should you fall, make use of this. GM Junior, thank you very much for the souls. Tip of the hat, appreciate support. Never, never think like that. Never think like, oh, it's not much. Like, bro, doesn't matter. I appreciate it. Never mandatory. Appreciate it, but. Never think like, oh my god, it's so little, but about it. Don't worry about it. I appreciate it. Thank you. Cowboy doesn't count. He has a nuclear plant for a PC. Yep. <clears throat> yep. Given you <clears throat> from now on, find your own way and stay. So let's place down one of these suckers. Because we're going to die a bunch of times in the upcoming boss. How much do I need to level up now? We're going to need 2,084 to level up. Okay. Because we want to level up before the boss, because we're going to lose whatever gets, whatever stays at the boss. Because unfortunately, picking up souls during boss fights, forget about that. You don't want to be doing that. It's like every time you need to pick up a soul in a boss fight in this game, you're going to get hit. Every single time. I might just cap it at 60. Let's try that. I hate this dude. Look at him. He's like all excited to see us again. He's like, I brought my dog this time. The hell with your dog, prick. Plunging, bitch! Plunged you like my toilet! I'm probably just gonna use a hard soul. I think we have some. Ah, it burns! It burns! The rusty cutter, which is another inferno weapon. I ended up never really checking what that eyeball did. Wait, did I pick up all the souls in here already? Oh. Going, going. We're missing just a little bit. Like I said, I wanted to check this out because... Still twitching residue from an umbral stigma. <clears throat> Uh, Shadow Fox, thank you very much for the souls. Tip of the hat, appreciate support. Thank you. Frustration and agony of lies of P. Yeah. <laughs> Still twitching residue taken from an umbral stigma can be traded with molu. Molu. 
Then we have the eyeball. Umbral Eye of Betrayed Elliard. Main socket effect plus one soul flay charge. Plus 15 dread resistance. Secondary socket effect. Healing efficiency while in umbral. Wait, what the fuck? Where do I put this? Sockets. I want to put sockets. The fuck? I guess you probably need special gear for that. And we don't have it yet. Hmm. Piece of skin taken from Samuel, a formal dark crusader executed for a dereliction of duty. And brother of Paladin Isaac. Okay. So, we're not going to be advancing any further because I'm going to get my ass clapped, my cheeks clapped by the boss, and I'm going to lose 1600 souls. So, real quick, let's just see exactly how many. 2084. Okay, we need to do one more and then I'll use Heart Souls. <laughs> so did you recover your save or had to restart? I had to restart. a single one of his hits. a second. I need to report this to one of the devs. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Now let me just uh, also give him this. It's like I've I've been I've been telling the devs like listen I got problems <laughs> I got problems help me <laughs> put this in footage I hope it does dude if this corrupts my save again oof Photoshop? Who cares, bro? Wait, I, that's the see. That's the reason why I don't close it. Let's grab this real quick. Here's how I close Photoshop. Okay, because that way it saves my files without me actually saving physical files. After eons of tyranny, has the level. demon yep. god Adir was finally overthrown. I did a I did a video with Ouroboros a while back, I think. Or if I didn't do one, I intended to do.
Anyway, now that we've reported the issue. <clears throat> Wait, why am I... Was I an umbral? Did I kill him? Is he alive? Oh, come on! He's full health! Wait, did I hear his dog? No, there's a dude here. Oh, he's glitched. Okay, I'll take that. Okay. No, 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 you were doing fine. You were doing so well. Okay, you good again? Good boy. There you go. Uh, the game is using Denubo? I don't know. I don't know what uh, DRM stuff they have. Why is this guy alive? Jesus. We are perfect. We can level up now. And then we can go to the boss. Pop, 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 pop. Do we go for another vitality? Yeah, we're going to go 15 vitality. All right, team, it's time to wipe. These 400 extra vigor that we have, kiss those goodbye, they're gone. To be honest, even at capped 60, this is just, just wonky, so it doesn't really matter. So we'll just do this, it's whatever. Let's go. Oh, holy Aureus, by your radiance, grant me the strength to continue to endure these dark days, to lay bare the path to salvation for my wayward brothers and sisters, so we may walk it together and to strike down all those who would see our will defied. Even as our suffering continued, I honored my pledge of patience to the Exactor. And yet you now appear before me, a stranger, bearing what was not yours to receive. That's what you say. made flesh, and one I cannot brook. Warm up round, warm up round, okay? Oh, come on!
Bozo. Told you guys we were gonna lose those. Damn it.
she caught me on the tail end of a dodge. <clears throat> hey Herman, what's up? Is this Melania too? No, this is the first boss of this game. It's actually fairly easy. I just haven't gotten good enough yet. What happened to my lock on? My lock on was just like, I don't feel like working anymore. What was that? It's so erratic when she gets to the the last couple of hits. You need to learn how to roll. You need to learn how to roll. I'm sorry. Bro, you have absolutely no fucking idea whatsoever what you're talking about. You just don't. You've never even played the game. You don't know anything. Good, good guy. Oh, holy. I'm 
considering that yesterday I rolled through like 90% of her attacks, I can roll through her attacks. But today I'm playing much more aggressive. The correction on that! That was dirty. No! Bro, we got Giga Cheese right there. That was such a cheese. The Giga Cheese, dude. I don't want to try parrying that move. I feel like you never get the parry off on that. There you go. <clears throat> this blood visual still looks really weird. I don't know what's up with that. Like, look at that. It's like claymation. This is not the demo version. This is the full game. Pieta Chan, I saved you. Brothers and 
sisters, you honor us and all who came before you with your sacrifices. While I wish they were unnecessary, my wishes will not ease your suffering, but I pray my sorcery does. Let me see if the thing from yesterday happened again. It did. I'm actually gonna rest down here and I'm gonna go get those items. Vitality to 15. Agility the 15. And I think endurance comes next. Yep. I've given you more from now on. Fine. Jeez, and I have to be so salty, bro. Bro, he got so salty, he left. He's like, you think this is a joke? I'm fucking leave. Okay. He logged out. Skyrest Bridge. Give me a second. Like I said, we're sending these directly to the devs. <laughs> I feel bad. <laughs> like, what the fuck, dude? Oh, wait. No, I was pressing the wrong key. There we go. The interesting thing is, you guys are saying, oh, we should probably get this on console. My concern, my, not even my concern, but my question is, assuming that this is better on console, that would make absolutely no fucking sense because the PS5 has an AMD GPU.
Oh, what the fuck is that? Bro, what's going on with dude's skirt? Bro, dude's skirt physics are going out of control. My man's got a raging boner under there. He's got the real drill, though, just waiting for us. What the fuck? He's like, just wait till you see what's under, what's under my skirt. Bro, I'm not interested. I don't want to see what's under there. Is he glitching balls? I think my man might be glitching balls again. This is hard. That's what's under your skirt. Okay, are we happy? Ooh, I got a crossbow. Nice. I think we're good here. Now, I could put a, a seedling here, but I'm not gonna. You don't need a seedling there. I feel like that's a waste. Oh yeah, here's something else I didn't do last time. There's a spell up here. Sanctify! back downstairs is there a crusader class available in this early access yes it, it I, I, I do find it a little bit confusing like you guys know how classes work in souls games yes just out of curiosity you guys do understand how souls classes work in these types of games basically the class is just your base template so the only thing you get with the dark crusader is an armor set and a set of stats. Every class can do everything. So it doesn't matter if I pick this class or the other class. The only thing that it changes is the stats you start with and the gear you start with. There's no such thing. This isn't like Diablo 4 where you have like, oh, I'm going to be playing as a necromancer. No, you can do everything with one class. Yeah, you might pick it for the role playing. True, true. I'll I'll abide that. I've never played the Souls game. Okay, good. Then now you know the classes that you get at the start. They're not that big a deal. They just give you your starting gear and a starting set of stats. That's about it. Quentin, Adam, thank you very much for being with us for 34 months. Tip of the hat, appreciate the support. Thank you. Dirty rat, you killed my brother, you dirty rat! Welcome, Dark Crusader. Hello! Where can I get a cool hat like yours? Welcome to Skyrest Bridge. Oh, look at the amount of eyeballs in here. Holy shit. Bro. No wonder this door ain't opening. It's got all them eyeballs in there. Probably an endgame zone or something. Me crying. Where's our wink? Oni-chan, chat. Thank you very much for getting us to 100 likes. I'll give you an ara-ara with it. Wait for it. Wait for it. 
<clears throat> ara, ara. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Keep reminding me. Because I'm I'm very I'm very bad at paying attention. If you guys keep reminding me, I'll keep handing them out. What the actual fuck, dude? Ark needs to go change his pants now. Sorry, Ark. That that's just the way it is, buddy. Uh, let me activate this. Wait, did we activate it already? No. Because it was like blue already for some reason. Oh, we can upgrade. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Do we go for endurance? I think we do. I think we do. And then I want to go more vitality even. Because right now, our... Right now, our scaling is actually not that great. So we're going to go for survivability to go. I had no doubt in my assessment of you as one worthy of the monumental task which lies before us, Crusader. My name is Dunmire, and I am an exactor of the Dark Crusaders, the holy order of which you are now an honored member. The Church of Orion Radiance has assigned to me the duty of purging Mornstead of its Rogar blight, and ensuring the ancient tyrant Adir feels no liberation from his enduring imprisonment. While the schism between the Church and Judge Cleric is of long standing, she and her hallowed sentinels, now perverted, did at least construct Mornstead's radiant beacons, which have prevented Adir's return for centuries. But now, we stand corrupted and on the verge of collapse. It is to these five beacons you must turn your eye. Use the Umbral Lamp to cleanse them of Adir's destructive influence and deliver salvation to a world on the brink of perdition. Rogar and Hallowed Sentinel alike will offer you no quarter. So remember, though Aureus mercy is without limit, yours should not be. Rogar and Hallowed Sentinel of the Aureus mercy. Okay. So, he sells the Purger Axe. We're actually not buying that. Um, I don't have a catalyst. Oh, here we go. Orion Preach, uh, Preacher Catalyst requires 12 Radiance. We're not going to be using that. Nope. This is full melee playthrough. Neophyte trousers. Nope. I might get the hat. See, the thing that bothers me about the hat is I suspect that if I'm to wear the hat, it's going to cover my face, and I don't want that. Dude, that neophyte hood looking a whole lot like the banded headpiece. Or is it the dark leather? Okay, it's been a long time. It's been a long time. Anyway, we don't need anything from him. Also, I do have something that I got from the boss that I don't know what it does. So this is a spell, right? Yeah. This right here is a spell. Do, 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 do. Took one through the team and clipped the ara ara. Oh no. <laughs> clipped by Ark forever in there. Remembrance of Pieta. She of blessed renewal. A golden pin. What type of an item is this? Tutorials, gestures, armor tincts, umbral eyes, quest upgrade materials. It's a quest item. Or an upgrade material. Okay. You. By Aureus' divine will, I live again. It's a miracle. He saved you. And to think I raised my sword to you, when all alone you were a divine instrument sent by him to deliver That's me. my death and rebirth and bring clarity. Yep, I'm Forgive here to kill. Me, You're quite I'm welcome. Pieta, 
of the hallowed sentinels. Jeta. And as Aureus sustains me, so too will I sustain you. Whether by making manifest your potential or through my healing blood, contained within the sanguinarix you carry. Should you find any saintly quintessences, bring them to me, and they can bolster the power of my blood further still. The beacons must be cleansed, the hallowed sentinels restored, and Adir's malignancy eradicated. Through whatever is to come, fellow chosen of Aureus, we stand together in service of him. Upgrade me! Fellow sanctified vessel, may Aureus divine radiance flow through me and into you. Into me? Now, now. I just had an experience in Baldur's Gate 3 that I would rather not repeat. Our holy word continues. Let's, uh, let's, let's keep let it. Will let's keep done. that into me conversation the for another time. Cleansed. The hallowed sentinels restored, and Adir's malignancy eradicated. Through whatever is to come, fellow chosen of Aureus, we stand together in service of him. She's the upgrade maiden now. She upgrades our healing items. Here is where we'll eventually have the blacksmith. She's not here yet. We still have to go get her. And over there, there's another character that I didn't show because I didn't even think to go there. Hello, my so friend. The exactors found himself a new instrument. As exactors are wont to do. And given Sanguinaris that is our healing Estus. Me, should his paladin fall. And yet now here you are. Lamp bearer. Well, it seems I was right to doubt the value of a dark crusader's word. Look, bro, you weren't gonna get the lamp, okay? I'm Stoneman, captain of the Fidelis, a group of good men and women who've made a stand against the madness which has possessed the rest of the hallowed sentinels. We made a vow to restore our order to its former glory, whatever the cost to ourselves. And by Judge Cleric's grace, we'll honor that vow. That heretical umbral lamp and the dark crusaders are necessary evils in these dire times. Am I like As Batman? I knew, it would seem. Perhaps our aims will align further. Does that make him Commissioner Gordon? Or perhaps not. That heretical eyes are you. Okay. So, he's got the same spear that I have. He also has the old Mornstead Pike, which deals more damage, but requires me to also put points into strength. Deals way more damage. But it also scales worse, so... Is the Partisan Shield just like a better shield than mine? Because that's what it looks like. No, because this one's a light shield. This one's a medium shield. Increases vitality and endurance attributes. Do I have 3,000? I like that. Hollowed Knight Leggings. Partisan armor. Mine's better than partisan armor. Nice. Mornstead infantry stonks go up. So we could get hollowed night leggings those are better partisan leggings are also better than mine i should try and get these Let's see if i can get away with it <sighs> interestingly enough mine my armor is actually really good like mornstead armor is really good but hollowed night armor is better is it's lighter and it's got more resistances. They're pretty close together though, so it's not really a big deal. Pilgrim's Perch Key. So this is the place that I can't go to yet. We're not supposed to show that location just yet. Then we have these two that are just farting Look around. Look at you. 
A dark crusader, a lamp bearer, and a revenant to boot. Aren't you the multifaceted one? Well, we Fidelis aren't as fortunate. We tend to stay dead when we die. And Aureus knows enough of us have done just that. Anyway, like Nathaniel says, you keep looking back, you don't see the blade coming at your front. We set ourselves a task and we have to finish it. Let's watch a step out there. Mornstead is a land awash in blood, both deserved and undeserved alike. Let's watch a step out. Mornstead is a land. I wonder if you can actually spawn enemies in here if you go to Umbral. I would assume no. The performance is better than yesterday, but I'm, I'm still gonna go out on limb and say that it was still better before. So, this is where you can buy some cosmetic stuff. Oh, you have to be online and logged in. Interesting. So you can't buy cosmetics if you're not online. That lamb Boo. you've got there is heresy, stranger. But then. Seems it's getting harder to tell what is and what ain't nowadays. Ah, <laughs> oh, strange times. But in the end, there's right and there's wrong. And that never changes. And I hope for both our sakes you know the difference. Nope. But if in doubt, you heed the captain. He's never steered me wrong. I don't think your captain much likes me. Think otherwise. But if in doubt, much as he might yeah, think. Yeah, I don't think your captain likes me, dude. Sorry. They were going to be a bit more thorough, too. Ah! Look at that little fucker. God damn, they're all over the goddamn walls, bro. How can y'all be so calm? Look at this shit. There's eyeballs everywhere looking at us. This is fucked up. Look, eyeballs over there. It's fucked up, dude. It's fucked up. I want that item. It's not open from this side. Rip. Yeah, we came here yesterday. I thought there wasn't anything. Can you go into Umbra at will? Yes, and as a matter of fact, we're going to do that. Like, you see, this is what you gotta pay attention to. Like, someone was asking earlier if this was going to get annoying. Like, notice how... Right? Here, everything is normal. Right? No strange sounds, no nothing. And then you come in here and listen. All these crazy eerie sounds. See what that means? There's something important in Umbra here. And then you pull out your lantern. It's like, holy monkey! I knew this guy was here. <laughs> I saw him earlier today. So, let's actually have a conversation, shall we? Hello, my guy. Who are you? The lamp must be born until the favored child makes themselves known. Only then can the remaining carrion of creation finally return to the void. Socket Umbral Eye. Oh, you put it in the lamp. Okay. And you can unequip it. Nice. 
I like non-committal things. Ooh, upgrade the lamp? Anti-diluvian chisel. So this guy deals with the lamp. The lamp must only okay. then can the remain. What else can we get from you? Charm of Fortune's Sight. This is a catalyst? <clears throat> Umbral Catalyst requires Radiance and Inferno. Okay. Umbral Orb. So this is for the other type of magic. Oh, we can buy Vestige Seeds off of him, too. Nice. Okay. What's going on here? Ooh, we can interact with this. Use Plucked Eyeballs to purchase items at the Molu Shrine. Let's go online. I want to see what are these things that I can buy. It's a lie! What the fuck? Bro, the game's calling me a cheater! What the fuck? Bro, the game just literally called me a cheater! This is some bullshit! First you corrupt my save, and then you try to besmirch my reputation? What is this? Oh, well, fine. Be that way. I guess we're not going to check that out. Game straight up calls me a cheater. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. They probably have the servers offline right now because they're patching the game very aggressively. At least that's what I would expect. Okay, let's go ahead and rest here. The beacons must be- and a deer's okay, fellow- she says the same thing. Hello! While the beacon should remain your most pressing task, I would have you perform another for me concurrently. Seek out and return to me the items which stand as proof of the hallowed sentinel's heretical deviations and practices. For only in the study of such can we hope to turn them towards the true light of Aureus. This land is overflowing with sin. So I expect this undertaking to offer you little difficulty. Also, say nothing of this to Pieta or the Fidelis captain. They are already conflicted. Troubling them further only endangers them and our mission. This land is to offer you little... Also, okay. they are already conflicted. All right. <clears throat> Not a useless, empty vessel like the one I saw that witless fool bumbling around with. I've learned a little since coming to Mornstead about that lamp and the awful mission to which it's attached. I hope you recognize that frightful burden for what it is. In truth, 
What's been done to you is downright cruel. Of course, some people are born into roles of tremendous responsibility. My name is Andreas of Ebb, esteemed scion of nobility. But far more than that, descendant of the great ruler Antanas himself. As proven by my family's book of lineage, for one. That's right. Through my veins flows the blood of the legendary hero who defied Adir and the Rogar and saved the whole world, only to be betrayed and murdered by a common criminal. So you'll understand a man of my pedigree cannot simply stand idle while an unfortunate victim such as yourself remains shackled to such a grim fate. Give me the lamp, hmm? and let me shoulder your burden, friend. What say you? No? It saddens me to see you bring such agony down upon your own head. I hope you see sense and reconsider. My offer stands, after all. What man of breeding would turn away from one so clearly in need? My offer stands, after all. Okay. So here's something that I just noticed. Down there is actually the place where we saw that item. I was wondering if we would see something here that would let us, like, go down, but... Oh, actually, no, it's a different item. And if you go Umbral, you can return from Umbral once you get there. Oh, I never noticed that. Dude, it's just there. Old Mornstead Spear. Is that the same? Oh, it's a different one from ours. It deals more damage than ours. Why? Because scaling. That's fine. We'll use this one for now. Pretty sure the move set should be the same. How do I get there, I wonder? Hello, brother. Uh, careful! If you're headed for Pilgrim's Perch, friend, uh, the hallowed sentinels don't welcome everyone. Not even a faithful pilgrim who's crossed countless miles of land and sea to join them. All I wanted was to serve the divine judge cleric, but they deemed me unworthy and chased me off. Okay, What's Quasimodo. A poor rejected disciple to do now, I ask you. You're supposed to die. I gave away most of what little I owned before I left Perdam. But uh, if you've got some traveling of your own to do, then here, take this. I know it doesn't look like much, but it's been a dependable companion to me. A fucking stick, bro. It's a harsh wind that blows in Mornstead, but a tree that doesn't bend breaks, I suppose. It's a harsh wind, but a tree that doesn't... A stick, bro? Saw you. Thought I didn't see you, huh? Oh, look at that. There's like a whole section of platforms down there. But I bet we can't fall down there just yet. This is the Mornstead Infantry. What do you want, huh? You son of a- Yeah, that's what happens, motherfucker. That's what happens. Oh, would you look at that?
Oh, you can... Oh! Shit, I was wondering how to do that last time. Nice. You guys remember how we didn't know how to get to this guy? Fuck you, buddy. I know where you live now! What the hell just hit me? Look at the giants in the background. Uh... Okay. Oh, hello. Oh god, this thing is like giga high level. What the fuck? Oh no! Ah. I hadn't seen that part. How about these? Are they also giga high level? No. Just the one up there. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Ow. <laughs> Gotta be careful. God. God damn, stop that. Oh, shit's getting real. No! There it is. There it is. There it is. There it be. Hey, you guys, you guys didn't see anything, okay? You didn't see anything. Shut, hey, shut the fuck up. I don't want to hear it. I think we might be able to bypass her, which might be the... The approach to take is just I wanted to take my time up there, but yeah, that ain't working out. He's seeing you, kid. Loud mace. No, 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 no. Remember what you did to me last time, you little shit? You get the fuck out of here. That's what you get. Map of Pilgrim's Reach. Pilgrim's Purchase. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> that is so satisfying. Just eating people off of cliffs. Oh, we're good. So, our souls are on the other side there. So that's actually fairly easy to get. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I yeet you? Oopsie. Okay. Now then. 
Do -do 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 -do. Give me this. My, my vigor. This time, I'm not just gonna kick you down. I'm gonna spike you, and then I'm gonna kick you down. God damn it. I hate those dudes. So annoying. Why don't you try some of your own goddamn medicine, bitch? That's what you get. So if I go all the way there, we can just like skip them. It's kind of I don't want to skip her though, that's the thing. I'm gonna murder her real quick. Except murdering her real quick doesn't appear to be an option. It takes too goddamn long to kill. I to murder these dudes real quick. What does this do? Let's find out. No, 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 no. Pale eye shield. Oh, we got the pale eye shield, but I never did kill her. I still want to do. Bro! Can you chill? Get away from me. Get the fuck away from me. You understand? Also, these are my swords. Coming back for you, bitch. I don't think you've seen the last of me. I like the goddamn Energizer Bunny. again, though. Got her. Told you I was gonna get her. Keep him coming! What's this? Gimme. There's also an item here. Gif. Gif. Okay. I think we've killed just about enough, no? I think we can leave now. Wait, if I go the other way, there's a thing for me to return to Axiom, which would actually be useful. Excuse me, boys. I know you're all spawning right now, but I am out of there. Axiom, baby!
All right. That was good. Now. Aww. Bro, what is it with these shield? Every single thing I get has like friggin' Inferno or other bullshit requirements. I don't want that. I never asked for this. That would have been funny if that hit him. Hey yo! What? No, I got staggered! Cheaters! I got friggin' stuck. Why can't I do a plunging? I guess that's not enough height. Alright. Well, I'm a risk it for a biscuit. Excuse me, boys. I win, you lose. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get some of that vital. Wait, I also want to get endurance. We're gonna get endurance up to fifteen, then vitality up to twenty. Hello, brother. Goodbye, brother. Oh, not this time, my friend. Know how to handle your kind now. That's what you get. Now, there should also be the one up there. Yep, I see you. I know you're up there. I can't target him. Anyway, there's a big boy coming. What's up? What's up, brother? Why can I not target him? Probably a distance thing, I would imagine. Really want to target him. One boy's got some health. There we go. Hey, motherfucker, catch! Ah! Oh! I lost target right there. Dunzo. I know that there's still one up here. I'm gonna be dealing with his ass right now. That's amazing jumping. Did you see him? He, he did a Dude, Dr. Disrespect talks about his vertical leap. That motherfucker could beat the crap out of Dr. Disrespect at jumping. He's like, yep, yeeted himself up here like it was nothing. What the fuck? Pretty messed up. So here's an interesting thing I didn't explore last time. There's all of this thing down here that we didn't go down to. 
Yo, bro, this is Sparta! Again! I would have expected one of the other dudes to come behind me. Try to take me over. Really? Nobody trying to eat me? I am surprised. Okay, yeah, there's definitely stuff down there that we didn't explore last time around. So I want to go do it this time. Our thing is right there. We just leveled up. We are at full potions, but no ranged, though. A little bit annoying. How is ranged ammunition replenished? You loot it off of certain enemies. It's RNG. I think? Or wait, can you maybe use... Maybe what you loot is the item and... Oh, no, you can, you can do this. Oh, that's actually a lot. Because I remember picking that up from enemies, but I wasn't sure. But yeah, you can replenish it like that, I guess. Oh. That is not open from this side. And we can't use this to go through. Look at all the content we didn't do last time. Holy crap. Oh. Hello. Sparta, bitch! You're out of there! Ah, look at him trying to push us. I knew you were back there. Well, I didn't know, but I suspected. Oh my god. This is really triggering my fear of heights. Listen, guys. In case you weren't aware... I am very much scared of heights. This is some bullshit. Yeesh. Hey, bro. Oh, crap, he's got one of them things. This whole section is just one big this is Sparta simulator. And that's a good thing, by the way, in case you were wondering. Oh god! Bro. Bro. It's out of curiosity. Wait, what? You are kidding. Wait, was that the platform that I was on earlier? Yeah, I think it was. Yeah, I think that that's that platform that we were on earlier, right? Definitely looked like it. <laughs> Chunk. Listen, boys, don't be mad. Y'all gotta go. Okay, it's just that simple. My apologies, but... In a way, I'm kind of conflicted with just how much of the scenery you could destroy. Is that something you guys are into? I'm actually curious. I'm gonna do a poll. gonna say wait this is not this is not a poll this is a q a what the hell do i know how to do things jesus okay scenario destruction destroy all the things this means you guys want like yeah fully destructible scenario let's go less is more this means you know you should destroy some things, but not everything. 
Maybe a little bit less than what we're seeing here. Just out of curiosity. Kicking them down, nothing to collect then? No, 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 no. When you kick them down, they drop their items behind. Uh, you might have not noticed, but yeah, they if they were to drop an item, it gets uh, dropped off to where they would have been right before they got kicked off. Like, you see how that little thing spawned? That's his souls. That's just soul drops. These guys don't actually drop anything, I don't think. Just souls. See? Another little souls thing forms. Another one. All of this is what they would have dropped if you were to kill them here. Happened. Oh, there's one of these little shits here. Oh, hello. Yeah, we skipped a lot of things last time by not coming here. Quite a bit of dudes and apparently some shortcuts. What's this? I guess that would be to call this elevator. Okay. Why do I have a feeling this floor is gonna break? Good God, that's scary as shit. Bell staff. Okay. Bell staff requires 12 radiance. Deals holy damage. Holy shit. Bro, I'm scared. I think this goes to the spot that we wanted to go to, though. There's probably something here. And this is just the thing to come back to Axiom, so that's not it. Ice grip! Yeah, hey, we got a new thing to paint! Ice grip. Uh, I can't see properly in these colors, we'll check that out later. That's probably just there in case you arrive there by being, uh, by being an umbral. Oh, what the hell is this? Is this the main door? Skyrest bridge key. Oh, damn. There's something on the other side there.
Wait, how do I get there? I guess I have to find the key or something. Oh, there's a thing there that we can shoot. Oh, and there's one on this side, too. Okay. Umbral, here we go! Doesn't seem like I can make it through here. Wait, I can't target that? Damn it, I can't target that. Charles Stansel, thank you very much for the souls. Tip of the hat. Appreciate the support. Thank you. This kind of sucks, because without, without that key, I'm basically stuck here now with no possible progression. Like, I have to basically make the run all the way back here again. If I want to try to do this again. I gotta be missing something. this offering I make to you. I feel like I should be able to do something here. Because, like, there's a little pathway. can't fall from here. There's no way I can make that jump. I can go umbral, but I can't swap midway, otherwise I'd do that, but even then I think it's too big of a drop. So we basically have to be coming in from the other side. Wonder if we can buy that sky rest key. Sky rest bridge key. Well, either way, we're kind of stuck here now, basically. So the only way is to go all the way back. Kind of sucks. Basically, the whole thing is come back when you come back.
come back when you get this key. Otherwise, no dice, my guy. Does that mean I have to do all of the jumps on the way back? Bro, I'm not looking forward to that at all. Not to mention doing all the jumps again if I ever want to come back here. Oof. Bro, I'm gonna fail the first jump. I can't make this jump. There's no way I can't make this jump. There's got to be a solution. Yeah, I saw in chat. You guys are right. I, I didn't notice. I didn't remember that you can do that. There's a thing we can do, which would be this. Now let me heal first. Just in case. Kyra's bridge key! Whoa! The fuck? Fuck you guys, I'm out! Did you guys see those fuckers? What the hell, dude? Oh, is this the door that I can open now? Nice. Crimson Rector Shield. So how good is this one? Requires Radiance! Because of course it does. Only 45. And it's considered a medium shield. Looks nice, though. But no, I just want light shields. Light shields only, thank you very much. Whoa! Oh, did they pull me in? I didn't know they could do that. Bet you can't come in here, though. Bet you can't come in here, though. Fuck you, man. Damn, you got health for days, don't you? What 
his own dude. Oh, he drops an item. Nice. Vestige seed. Nice. Come on over, little bro. They both drop vestige seeds? Well, since you pulled me into Umbral, it'd be rude not to. Ooh. This is so tight, though. I love the fact that they can pull you into Umbral, though. That was really cool. to deal with. She's just gonna keep pooping him. We just don't have the damage right now. Well, she's gonna come all the way over here. She's gonna do that. Got a lot of stuff. This bears grasp, wither salts, vestige seed. Hells yeah, brother. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I always like chucking spears. Crimson Rector Sword. And those days are gone. So you can get the Crimson Rector Shield and the Crimson Rector Sword. Okay, I think that was a pretty good haul. I think we can leave now. Wait, though. Can I go... No, I don't think I can go back, right? Be great if I could go back there. Now I do need to check something real quick, guys, because I know that there's areas that we're not supposed to show. And I don't know if it's just Pilgrim's Perch or if it's also whatever this sky bridge thing is. Let me just get the hell out of Umbral because things can attack us while we're still in Umbral. Mm -hmm. The 
Is embargo out of goodwill or a lock by the developers? It's like, look, the way embargoes work is like this. Depending on the publisher, they might ask you to sign an NDA, which means that it is a legally binding thing. Although usually, in most situations, nowadays they don't really do a lot of NDAs. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. So the embargo thing here is not by law. But if you break an embargo, number one, you're a fucking scumbag because, you know, there's a there's an understanding when you're like, I'm going to abide by this embargo, right? There should be an understanding as two people that are dealing in earnest, right? So I never break embargoes. It's just like, that's it. I will never break embargoes. It's just never going to happen. But technically speaking, it would not be illegal for me to break the embargo. It would just be a really fucking scummy thing to do. And the thing is, you know, everybody in the CM community, they talk to each other. So you get one of those as a content creator. You get one. And then that's it. Nobody else will work with you ever again. <laughs> now let me see here, because there is an embargo on some of the stuff, and I want to make sure that we don't go over it. Let me see. So... I can show, do not access these two areas. Okay, I can use the sky bridge key. I can use the sky bridge key. There's nothing here about the sky bridge key. Although interestingly enough, there was a dude that like, leaked all kinds of shit he had access to you know he had ac early access because he's a content creator i think in australia and he had early access to a lot of shit and he leaked it on like an alternate account and that became public and people still work with him like he's been interviewing all of the voice actors for baldur's gate 3 but, you know Still, I wouldn't recommend it. You serve a higher purpose, Crusader. Do I want to risk the hat? To no, we only have 1,400. Now, let's see. If I remember correctly, Skybridge Key was where we fought the first boss. Brunette dude right with the glasses? No. I don't think so. Did he have glasses? I forget. Maybe. And once again, we're here. Wait, is he not attacking? And there it is again. Is this just the same thing? I think this is just the same thing. Yeah, I'm going to stop spamming this dude. This is literally the same code.
It's not same spot every time. Okay, so it looks like when it comes to the destruction thing, most of you guys want to be able to destroy everything. Interesting. I would rather some things remain uh, not destructible. It keeps some sort of... Um, some sort of, like, semblance in the level, After so to speak. Does that make sense? The deep... Bro waking up to 100 bug DMs. Yeah. part is how the enemies are for health. Like, this guy was dead already. Please don't. I can dance all day, I can dance all day. Try and hit me, try and hit me. Boom, headshot. That's what you get, buddy. That's what you get. Look at you. Look at you. Look at you. Oh, he dropped his sword. What a nice guy. <sighs> this one does not open from this side. Wait, where was it then? I think it might have been the door down here then. I didn't even have to kill him. We just killed him for fun. Rest. Sky Rest Bridge. Okay. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, what? That's it? That's it? Well, there's also the other door. There's one more door that this thing opens. So I need to go do that one. Okay, in that case, uh, did we rest already? Yeah, we did. Oh, uh, we go this way. We have to do all- No, no, wait, we don't have to do all that path, do we? Do we? We do. We have to do the whole path again. Rip. Am I really going to make a run through all of that? That's going to be messy as fuck. Wish me good fortune, my brothers! Bruh! 
Bro, look at these dodge rolls. Holy shit. Woo. Look at this. They see me rolling. They hating. Wait, were those bell plants? Bro, we just keep on winning. Don't you give me no bullshit. Don't you give me no lip. Oh, I got a pilgrim skirt. I'm sure it smells nice, too. Look at that motherfucker ready to eat us. Fuck you. The thing that I want to know is I've seen a developer do like this, uh, this double kick, the, a drop kick. And I was like, bro, that's what I want to do. Oh, shit, this guy's got a thing. No, not that. Get rammed in the corner, sucker, ch sucker chump. Get out of here. Go on, skedaddle. Hey, yeah! Oh my god, that was so close. No! <laughs> all right. Umbral. Right, all right, right. I keep forgetting. Two chances to fail. <laughs> I've never been so thankful for a feature in a video game in my life! Rurikon dies twice. Access is one hell of a drug. I think this one's different though, or is it the same? Nope, same. Same code. Yep, same one. Exact same code. Jesus. <laughs> You're the first streamer I've seen have all these crashes. I wonder what it is. I know exactly what it is. I'm probably the only streamer that's using an AMD GPU. Team Red, baby! That's what I get for Team Red. I don't know if AMD's gonna give me a goddamn sponsorship. All this bullshit that I'm dealing with. I should have gone Team Green. <laughs> The worst part is that I really, I, I like my GPU better than I like NVIDIA GPUs. And I think it's a better value proposition than NVIDIA GPUs. And overall it performs really well, it's just whenever new games come out... Rip. Wait, who the fuck is this? Oh right, we're in Umbral now. Hey boys, we got two for the price of one. You son of a-
Don't you fucking laugh at me. I see you guys laughing at me in chat. Don't you fucking dare. It's a trap. about the little dude. Oh god. Gotta be careful with these goddamn roll dodges. Keep myself off the goddamn... Really, bro? Really? Don't speak. Die. Did my character jump that way? What the fuck? Don't you fucking dare, little shit! some bullshit and nobody got time for that I know where I'm going oh crap the elevator's not here use it use it quick get lightning nope ha why is it so dark damn could you guys have bring any more Now listen guys, I'm gonna take this elevator and you guys can stay there. Bye! See y'all later, bitches! Later, haters! Alright. Okay, let's do this. Yoink! We back in Axiom! I know exactly where we're going. Right here. Now you listen here, I've sacrificed a lot to come here. I better not be sacrificing any more. Understand me? Well, I don't like what I'm seeing there. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Vigor skull. Big chests. 
This scryer guide leggings. The scryer guide garb. Paint vigor skull. Paint vigor skull. Who's this? Is that Booba? Shortcut. Yes! Yes! We did it! We did it, team! We friggin' did it. Let's go. Upgrade my shit. More vitality. Bro, oh. do my vitality. Whoa, hello. Okay, so there's an event thing here. Wait, we didn't rest. Idiot. Idiot! The way he runs looks like friggin' Humpty Dumpty. Unga bunga. Unga bunga with spear. Belly straw. It takes a while getting used to the, the combat and movement. But once you get used to it, it can be really, uh, can be really fun. Not perfect. Challenging. Um, I really like the level design. I like the mechanic of, uh, showing you the different worlds and whatnot. The Umbral world and the normal world and all of that. That's fun. Oh, look at that. There's a hole here. Speaking of secrets... Didn't expect that. But yeah, I think there's some decent fun to be had. Problem is I'm experiencing uh, some performance issues and crashes because I have an AMD GPU. So if you have an NVIDIA GPU, I think you're somewhat in the clear because I haven't heard any complaint. From peeps with NVIDIA GPUs. But <clears throat> if you have an AMD GPU, you might want to hold off. Where does this go to, I wonder? Let's find out. Oh, wait, I know. But I can't fall down there. I'll die. Isn't this a death drop? Ow. No, just a painful one. Okay. So why would you want to fall there? I have an Intel GPU. Does it work? I don't know. But if AMD is struggling... I don't know how Intel's gonna be doing. <sighs> 
So I'm curious, before we jump back down again... Like, what's the purpose of this? Is it just to get the items that we found around here? Because I don't see what other reason you would have to come in here. Oh! Is the store open? No. Ah, uh, there'll probably be like a ladder here later, I would imagine. Or some other form of shortcut, maybe. We'll see. Oh, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool chandelier. Now we have to come down here because there was still some stuff to explore. Ah! Why do they have masks on their bellies? Whoa! Okay, so we gotta break that. Look at that hand over there, dude. What the fuck? Wait, that's an item. Idiot. Princess's Sting. I'll look at that in a bit. Or maybe I'll forget about it and never look at it ever again. It's also a possibility. one over here, okay. See what I mean? This is what I'm saying. Like, I really do like the, the puzzles that we get to do when we're in this thing. I think it's actually pretty well done. You thought I didn't see you, didn't you? Did I get him already? I don't know if I got him or not.
I think we did. All of that for whatever is in here. Searing accusation. Okay, so we got a couple of things to look at in our inventory. Well, there doesn't seem like anything attacks us here, so... So we picked up this thing, a pendant of solid gold fashioned in the image of a particularly aggressive insect of the Oathlands. Deal additional damage with a smaller equip load. <clears throat> I mean, I don't really have anything else. Searing accusation, a collection of severed fingers which serve as an inferno catalyst. Damn, I gotta talk to Cowboy, see if he found this one yet. Gotta help out our boy with his guides. If he hasn't found it yet. All right, and then there's still this thing to do. Their words are veiled when they speak to me of it, but I know what they think. That by marrying such a minor noble, I'm putting my own happiness before the good of the royal line and the welfare of Monster. But they don't see in her all of the things that I do. This kingdom is my home, and I will do everything I can to protect it, as I always have. As you did, Mother. But I refuse to accept that that requires forsaking the woman I love. Sophia only makes me a better man, a better king. And Monstead will be all the stronger with her at my side. Okay. <clears throat> Looks like we did the sky bridge bit. That was a nice little side quest that we hadn't done before. Now time to continue down the main path. My opinion, consoles should have all the graphic options as PC within reason, of course. I fundamentally disagree with that. Consoles should have no visual options. Developers should choose for themselves. This is how we want the game to look. It'll run at 60 FPS. This is the best graphics we can squeeze out of it at 60 FPS. Boom, done. I'm be real. I don't give a damn about the people that are like, oh, I'm not, but my 4K 30. I don't. I don't care, dude. Sorry. I don't. I don't care. I don't give a flying fuck about your 4K at 30 FPS. Okay. I don't. I don't. You shouldn't be playing at 4K if it means you're playing at 30 FPS. Everybody should be playing 60 FPS. I am <clears throat> a 60 FPS absolutist. Unless you can't because like you're playing on. You know, Switch or Steam Deck or whatever. That's a different conversation, or if your system's limited. But if you're in a console that can do 60 FPS, everything should be 60 FPS. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Maybe that's a hot take. I don't give a flying fuck. But my choice, your choice makes an inferior product. Unless for whatever godforsaken reason developers want to be like, No, I want to make my game 30 FPS. Okay, have at it. In that case, optimize the game for 4K 30 and be done with it. None of this... None of this, uh... Oh, but our, it does... It, there's a performance... I don't want performance modes, bro. Not interested. I'm not buying. Okay, 
Because I also want to leave some freedom for the developers, right? They're going to be like, no, but I want to make a 4K experience. Okay, then make your 4K experience and don't make a performance mode. Just don't do it. Just don't do it. Because no joke, nine times out of ten, when a game has a performance mode, it's not a very good thing. It's usually bad with the 4K and it's bad with the 60 FPS. Save for very few exceptions. Graphical options, if you want to have them, would be stuff like motion blur, film grain, which, by the way, can we, can we talk about how film grain is potentially one of the biggest pieces of cancer in video game media? Who the fuck wants film grain? Film grain? You mean make the image dirtier on purpose for no reason? Film grain? Film grain. You understand, film grain, film grain was an undesirable effect because of old technology. We do understand this, yes? Film grain. What the fuck, bro? Brother, you're going too far. What do you mean? You want film grain? Who the fuck wants film grain? Hey. The cleric's welcome comes behind the edge of a sentinel's blade. More often than not in this place. Makes me curious how you're still breathing. I suppose dangling the promise of salvation from one hand and the threat of death from the other keeps a pilgrim obedient. <laughs> okay, now, now I'm going to have a problem. Now you guys are going to be mad at me. Now you guys are going to be mad at me. I actually like Chromatic Aberration. I don't know why. Ever since I saw it in Bloodborne, I was like, I like this. If you guys notice, in my game, Chromatic Aberration is turned on. It is what- It is the only setting that I like- Although, within reason, because like, if you go to, for instance, Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak, Chromatic Aberration in there is terrible. Because they Chromatic Aberration the fuck out of like all the way from like I don't know let's see if this is the screen they start chromatic aberration like almost at the middle uh, that's too much chromatic aberration needs to be giga subtle to the point where you can barely tell it's there but I like it I like chromatic aberration chromatic aberration I actually do like I will say that I think chromatic aberration adds something that none of the other things do because chromatic aberration is not in your face, it's in your peripheral vision, and it kind of keeps me focused on the middle of the screen. <laughs> That's why you're crashing? What, chromatic aberration is why I'm crashing? No, I don't think so. What if I could, like, drop one of these bells on the boss? Now that would be the shit. That'd be the shit right there. Chromatic aberration adds a headache filter? No, 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 no. I suffer from migraines. Chromatic aberration doesn't give me a headache. Okay, here we go. Fuck you, you little shit. Let me run away! Bro, what the fuck? I was, like, stuck there. Bitch, you suck. Ah! 
Damn it, she hit me. I actually don't like fighting her down there. I don't like that at all. I feel like it's actually better just to fight her here and not deal with her little parasite dude. Little shit. She's such a spammer, dude. Vengeful 8 Gaming. They must be paying him good to do another playthrough after a corrupted file. Get that bag, man. I'm just curious. Do you actually believe the bullshit that just came out of your mouth, or you're just memeing? Because you do understand when you say something like that, you're basically calling me dishonest for not disclosing it. So I'm curious. Do you believe it, or are you memeing? One of her moves is very deceptive because she hits you on the way up and then on the way down again. I'm actually surprised that they didn't do the thing that a lot of people are doing with the uh, early access release where you can pay extra or something. They're not doing that in this game, right? As far as I'm aware. I'm just asking because I see all you guys talking about, oh, I'm playing it on Thursday, I'm playing it on Friday. I don't think they're doing it, right? I, I should check. 
No, there's no early access versions. Okay, respect, dude. Fucking respect. I don't like that at all. That's basically like you're deciding, ah, oh, you're poor, you pay later. It's like some form of classism. I really don't appreciate when video games do that. Putting a starting class behind a paywall, it's not a big deal. I don't like it, but I don't think that's a big deal at all. Like, classes in this game don't mean as much as a lot of people think they do. respect you're getting early access I wanted I already have to play listen muscle memory I want you to understand something when it comes to that particular argument I'm completely on your side I'm actually on the side that nobody should get early access like literally nobody not me not content creators not uh, mainstream media everybody should jump into the game at the exact same time but guess what that's not really up to me but I agree. I don't think I don't think I should have early. I don't think anybody should have early access. But it is what it is. Only for reviews, maybe under embargo. Nope. I disagree. You want to make a review? Get the game. She's got way too much reach. She's got a fucking flail and she outreaches my spear. Too much reach.
that's what you get. Frankie Cutlass, thank you very much for the souls. Tip of the hat, appreciate the support, thank you. Do, 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 do. Right, can I speak more with the, the chick that's in here? Not. Just give me a minute to speak with her. Uh, you know, not long ago. Now it's. I know they'd see you rejuvenate those obscene monument don't. That's their salvation, but you won't find it in them. Their self, but you okay. won't find. It. Uh, let's go back down. Down, 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 dun, 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 dun. I wonder if you can get her flail as a reward. I'm pretty sure we do. Yeah, Scourge Sister Flail. Ooh, Saintly Quintessence! Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. We ain't got no health, though. Fuck you, bitch. Nobody likes it. Oh, damn. That's not good. I was about to make fun of him and say that nobody likes him, but... I remember this. Give, 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 give. Yes. Wait. What? I know that there's a thing here. Where's the thing? I remember there being a thing here. What do you mean? What the fuck? Oh, I have to put it down? No. But I'm lazy. Yeah, we have to put it down. I thought there was a proper one here. Do do do. Okay, that's 20 vitality. Next up we go endurance. Although I only want to take Endurance to 15. And then we're going to start leveling all three of them up at the same time, I think. Okay. Now that we've done that, I actually want to go back here. Hello, brother. Goodbye, brother. Wait, there's nothing here? Ah, but there is. Lacerating knife. That's a throne thing. Aw, oh, is that it? Ugh, big hand. Or it almost seems like you're not going to make that jump. That is a harsh jump. Wink! Is it wink time? It is wink time. Wink time! Onicha! We hit 300 likes! 
あらあら<笑>はい。I'm back. Please never do that again, Rui. I'll do it again if we get to 400 likes. Then I'll do it again if we get to 500. Pilgrim's Perch. <clears throat> oh god, I remember this part. This part is the worst. <laughs> Although this time, I am better. Come on, show your, show your face up in here again, I'll tell you. Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. Oh, 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 you want some more? There you go, bitch. I see you. Really, bro? Let's see how Spear handles this guy. Oops. And penitent torso chains. Yes, yeah, just what I wanted some torso chains. We got a plain shield. Oh, we got to go umbral. We must go umbral. I see him up there, the little shit. I think I don't. What the? I think I don't see you, motherfucker. I see you up there. Fuck you. Wait a second, if I can't lock on to you, why can you lock on to me? Oh, I love the range, dude! Come on over, bitch. Do it again. Hey! What the- I'll be right over, motherfucker, don't you worry. Oh no, I won't. I remember this part. You guys saw Big Boy Chan up there? 
Maybe I have a plan. What in the mother fuck? <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> oh my god, dude, what the fuck was that? <laughs> Okay, it's getting pretty fucking hype up in here. Excuse me. Enemies near. Fuck them. Not near anymore. Get the fuck away from me. You get the fuck away from me. There. Take me back to Axiom! I'm so happy that dude just uh, yeeted himself into oblivion. That was fantastic. I approve of that strategy. Hey, motherfucker. Really, bro? Really? Fall. Oh. I'll be right over, bitch. Don't you worry. Let's try. Hollowed praise. Wait, did I get another one of those swords? Who oh, knew? Really, bro? Really? You think you're clever? Bum. So how do I deal with this? I think we gotta... I think we gotta do a little bit of this, right? Yep. Yep, yep. Is that guy aggroing me? You aggroing me, bro? You seem pretty upset. Well, Umbral, here we go. Let's go, baby! supposed to do up here but troll figured out oh we go through here clearly and now we trigger the staircase holy crap why do I have like no health this is very dangerous with 2800 vigor on me I don't like that at all Trigger it. Shortcut. Let's go, baby. Get that. Thorn Crimson Reactor Sword. Okay. Fuck this guy. And then run away. Yep, I knew you were coming. And he's got a friend on top of it, too. You were gonna push me. You're still trying to push me. But I'm gonna push you. Okay, so I have no idea where I'm going now. Oh, 
Oh, he's still here. Oh, it's this way. Yes, 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 yes. God damn, brother. Hells yeah, brother. We did it. We friggin' did it. Can we level up? Level up. Let's do one endurance. And then I think we might go further vitality. I kind of want to start going vitality, agility. Vitality, agility. But we are at a very important part of our journey. What do I need for this? Pilgrim's Perch Key. Okay. Can't open that one just yet. Another lamb bearer. Aye. So it goes. Should you end up one of the few to earn a vestige, I'll tend to it. As I do. For whatever it's worth. And until I'm in the ground myself. Until I'm in the ground myself. The hallowed sentinels and Rogar will both show you horror enough. But nothing like what that lamp brings into view. And remember, you look into the shadows. Might be the shadows look back. Yes. Mind yourself, lamp bearer. Whether you took up that light willingly or not, you're on a treacherous path. And forever's never as long as you think. Mind yourself, you're on a mind yourself, Lambert. Oh, there's a book. Pilgrim's Perch Descent. Can't go through the door. You gotta go this way. Then you gotta go in there. Whatever that's supposed to mean. These maps are so weird. <laughs> Take that, buddy. Should I try parrying him? Sure. So fast <laughs> What's he doing? Well, now he's screwing the wall, but look at those hip movements. That's pretty messed up. Let the man enjoy his kinks, damn. Sure. Go for it. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Interesting. What do you want, bro? Stop. Stop peeking. Can't you see I'm busy? See, that's another place I didn't go to last time. 
Bro, can you die already? Like, die. You're fine. You're happy now? Oh, right. There's still quite a bit for us to explore before we actually... Before we actually get uh, free from this. <laughs> you little shit. Look at him. You can't even see him. Take that. I wonder what gives me more ammo. Is it endurance or is it agility that gives you more ammo? Or is it vitality? Because I am getting more ammo. Or is it just maybe your levels? Whatever it is, I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, we have homeboy over there. <laughs> really? Really? I guess you can't jump back to that one. That means I have to fight him. Okay. Do it! Do it! Do it! Come on! Miss me, bitch. Fighting these dudes is just a waste of potions. They're just here to waste of potions, that's it. I like the first enemy I started skipping in this game. Because they're just so ungodly annoying. For all intents and purposes, they take no damage. Anything from here, so could just skip them. Oh no, I need it. I need my friggin' thing back. See ya. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, there's a vestige thing here. That would have been useful. Because I know that this part is a goddamn nightmare. Did I have placed one here too? I guess I could have. Oh, oh, oh. Oh shit, one of the big ones is there. I hate those ones. Should skip this. It's gonna become a cluster for the best day here. Although they sometimes do drop good gear. Speaking of gear, I haven't really checked my gear in quite some time. Really, bro? Really? Get out of here! <laughs> Big shortcut unlocked. Dude went right through that pillar. I don't even know where I am anymore. It's probably the right way though. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Aha, miss me bitch. mistake. Oh, I remember this part. Boy, do I remember this part. I do.
What do you mean too much for PC to handle? My rig can run this game five times simultaneously, dude. Too much for my PC to handle. Bro, running like a gazelle doesn't help. What the fuck? Is oh, I'm sorry. I, I, ca I can't run in the game. Otherwise, it can crash. Get the fuck out of here. What? I hope you're joking. You gotta be joking, right? You can't, you can't possibly be serious. You wanna run too fast? Might crash the game. Like, what the fuck? What kind of a thought process is that? Wait, I pulled it? Oh, I need to pull the last one. Oh well, I'll take it. I have a pretty good idea where I'm supposed to go. Let's see if I can make it down. Yeah, I can. Miss me, bitch. See ya. Load things fast enough? This game is on an NVMe drive. It can't load things fast enough, I can assure you it's not because of my computer. Okay, we should be able to get one more level, right? Now it's time for us to join the struggle bus for a little bit. This is where... dog I have to deal with. <clears throat> what in the mu- are you- what? Who? From where? Oh, there's a dude over there, you little shit. 
he threw himself down to snipe me. That guy, he was up there. He came down, broke his, broke both his legs to shoot me with lightning once. Gotta hand it to him. That motherfucker's dedicated to the cause. Where's he at? There you are. I beat his shit in through the floor. I want to get those souls, though. Go. And these souls. And these ones. And this. And this. And. Gotta open that. First. Blacksmith. <laughs> Insult to Gerlinda's skills. Waste of her time. Work on before the winged woman, did the auto farm still go on after patches? Yes. And it's not really auto farm, because you're, you're resetting. Of these fools. Good. That key. And it over. No one gets the better finally. Make a slave of Galinda. Ha! You made a slave of me. Shut up, Sparky. You don't count. Doing an old growl a kindness. Aren't you a credit to your species? <laughs> Doing an old... <laughs> okay. That's done. <laughs> Pilgrim's Perch. Rip Bozo. Okay, so now we... Boink. Defiance Ring. Oh, I haven't really done jewelry in quite some time. Well, looks like I didn't have much anyway. Bleed cure. Oh, there's an item up there. Yes, I will eventually do another uh, Baldur's Gate 3 campaign. I'm just waiting for them to polish the game up some more. That game has some serious issues. Isn't there another dude in here? I guess not. This goes to the boss. We're not going to do the boss yet. That boss is going to be annoying as hell. BG3 co-op campaign. It's very hard to find people that want to commit to doing a full campaign of Baldur's Gate 3 on livestream. It's very hard. So, you're starting to see through their lies. Church, crusaders, sentinels, corrupt hypocrites, butchers and madmen, a lot of them. Adia. 
The one true god stands on the verge of finally returning and restoring order to this broken world. And what do they do? Defy him. Fucking heretics. Fucking heretics. And I'm wondering if a deer might have a purpose for you. It takes strength to survive in this world, and Mornstead's no different. Adir's got no time for the weak, and neither should you. Cut them down, and take what they've got for yourself. <laughs> A deer's rage. Oh, look, it's, um, what's it called? Inner, or is it rage within? I got inner power. I forget whatever it was called in Dark Souls 1. Yeah, we're not buying anything off her this time. I just want spears. Spears, lady. I'm here to spear. It takes. Adir's got no. Cut them down. Crashing is very kind. PC specific, or does it happen for the rest playing people? Um, I believe it is because I'm one of the few people that runs an AMD 6900 XT. That's the only reason I can think of. But yeah, I don't know. So, we've gotten that. Now we're going to jump up here. Did I get new armor pieces at all? Oh my. My helmet's better. Do, 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 do. Man, the armor this class comes with is really good. Yep. Except for the legs. I don't like these. I might actually swap to these just because I don't like the way the other ones look. Okay, now that I'm here, I also want to check out the underwater section over there. Get down there, goddammit! Really? You're not gonna go down? Okay. Dude's flying over there! What the hell? Stop cheating! He's trying to reach me with this bullshit. Bruh. That's what you get. Don't beg for your life, bro. Just die. There you go. Okay. Now that we've cleaned these dudes up. Umbral, here we come.
Oh, the butterfly bitches. Damn it. Friggin' coomers all over this place. Umberlai Rosamund. Oh damn, explosions everywhere. What could possibly go wrong? Antique hollowed sentinel armor. Jesus Christ, look at the number of dudes in there. But we can put a seedling thing here. does this go to? Also, let me check out that armor real quick. Wait, did I rest yet? No, rest. I always forget to rest. Oh damn, this is better than mine. 
almost looks like Solaire's helmet. Not quite. Antique Sentinel. Yep, this is also better. And we can keep medium, which is good. Holy shit. Let's fucking go, boys. New armor. Bleed resistance bomb, so there's actually nothing here. The only progression here is towards that big pile of dudes. Did this actually do anything? Mechanism seems to be stuck. Well, who wants to live forever? <laughs> Who's gonna try and push me off? I mean, come on. We've done the- uh-oh. Uh-oh. There goes 1800 Vigor. I wasn't really using it anyway. Uh, does he have it? Oh, there's actually a ladder over here that I can drop. Oh yeah, he does have it. That little shit. Thinks he's so smart. <laughs> Fuck you. Try and do that again, bitch. Wait, 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 wait. Who's your friend? What the fuck? No, what? Fuck you guys. I'm coming in here and I'm looting this. Oh, your friend fell. Oh no. Oh no, I feel terrible. The correction on that attack is just ridiculous. I guess I was gonna have to come here anyway. real familiar with that vestige right there.
like that. Are you for real right now? Sniping me from across the fucking map? Hello? Wait, did I not pick... Here I go again, here I go again. I did, I did recover. spawn back there and we got the item why be so greedy all of a sudden because I don't have enough damage to deal with that all of those enemies that were in that platform but I wanted the item anyway and I got the item I got it I took it from them and there was nothing they could do about it Increase maximum health. Nice. I'll take it. I also have the Bowl of Revelations. Whatever good that's for. Okay. I'll take this. It's not even that much, but, you know. Every little bit helps. Wait, where's my health? Don't tell me. Did the motherfucker shooting get my health? Fuck now. What was... Oh, final chance. Where the- 
shit. That is some next level shenanigans. Okay, so where is my health thing? If it's even anywhere. Like, look at the amount of dudes that are in there. This is absolute insanity. Dude, I have no idea what is in there, but it's got to be, like, hella good. Whatever items are being kept here, they need to be, like, the best items in the whole goddamn game. Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay. Nice. How many is in here even? Not that many. Okay, that's fine. Look, we got nothing to lose at this point. We're gonna go get it. We got nothing to lose, baby. Just try killing them? Yeah, good luck. Good luck with that. I'm sure you'll do great. You fools. I took the only thing I cared about and I left. And you can't stop me. That little shit's gotta die. Now, where is the Templar dude? Templar dude. There you are. Did he just threw his shield at me like Captain America? I want to do that. Time to die, baby. You guys remember doing the Taurus Demon like that? <laughs> I 
I'd rather get both of them at the same time. That did like no damage. As a matter of fact, I think it healed him from how little damage it dealt. You guys see his health go up? Fuck! Die! Good lord. Alright. Pure blade helm. <clears throat> we got back about as much as we had previously. There's that. Now what's going on here? I guess we can't use it from here. We have to go to the other side. Okay, time to jump into Umbral with no health whatsoever. That'll be fun. Possibly go wrong. Oh, well, we got some health back at least. Breeze blowing softly across the sand. Deep blue sky. <laughs> the songs we used to sing. Little Daljaru's hand in mine. All so far away now. All gone. Mother. Father. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Alright, we did it. Okay, I think we've explored everything there was to explore in this area, right? I don't see anything left. We did the thing all the way over there. I mean, supposedly we'll eventually get like an elevator here or something. But we don't have that yet. These levels are so friggin' intric intricate. Like, I'm actually impressed. Actually, I shouldn't have warped here. We need to warp he uh, here. Blacksmith should be here now, and I actually want to upgrade this one because it'll scale better than this one. found herself a place to do a little business. She hasn't seen any other Growork since arriving in this shithole kingdom. But, Growork or human, 
Sturdy armor and lethal weapons are a universal language. Speaking of business, Gelinde has something you might be able to help with. She's looking for some items. This vining bag of bones left in Mornstead a long time ago. You can tap exclamation Galinda specs for my specs. Deserving of what she seeks, traveler. And self-centered besides. You would do well not to aid her in it. You know full well the agony Galinda can inflict on you as long as you wear those manacles, Sparky. My name is not... Silence! Annoying as he is, Sparky does possess certain very rare knowledge, which he refuses to share. But he carves this knowledge in crystal, and now Gerlinda wants those crystal tablets to help in her runes missing. So, if you find any in your travels, bring them to Gerlinda, and she'll do right by you. Lone the Hunter, thank you very much for becoming grossly and goodness for five months. Tip of the hat. Appreciate the support. Thank you. As I would not to Galinda, I will not reveal the locations of the tablets to you, traveler. Even upon pain of death. Oh. Ah, you again. Oh. Can I upgrade my throne spears? Oh, I don't remember picking up this one last time. This one deals holy damage and bleed. This one scales with strength. One forty nine plus seven. One thirty eight plus six, but bleed. Okay. Aw, you don't get to upgrade your throne items. That sucks. I was super excited about not having to use like crossbows and shit. I wanted to actually upgrade the spears that I can throw. If only I could be Guess so we haven't gotten that far. Oh, I picked up an Ungabunga weapon. I believe Cowboy was looking for one of these. Do you guys remember where I picked this up? Rafini, thank you very much for becoming grossly incandescent. Tip of the hat. Appreciate the support. Thank you. Do you guys remember where we picked this up? I know that cowboy was looking for one of these weapons. So we're gonna upgrade this. Man, really? So like, you can't upgrade this? Or javelin? Really wish you could upgrade this. Did you pick it up in the place? I don't remember. This is an Ungabunga weapon. This weapon attacks as fast as my fucking spear. How's that possible? This puny spear attacks about as fast as that weapon. <laughs> Again. Oh, 
<laughs> Cause see, like I can buy this one, and I can just use this. Be done. See, it's considered ammunition, it's not considered a weapon. But then again, this would be 87 damage. Whereas my javelins... Wait, how is it 87 damage? And then the arrows deal 115 damage. What the fuck? How does that work? Like, how does it work that you throw these arrows that deal 115 damage? Robson Souza, ninguém fala português aqui. Yeah, I don't know how bows work versus the thrown weapons. For now, I'm keeping my thrones. It just kind of sucks I can't upgrade them. I really wanted to upgrade them. Oh well, Ripperonis, does this scale? Almost not at all. Okay, we're upgrading the fuck out of this. The fuck is a big word. We don't have enough. Wait, I don't, I don't have the materials even. Yeah, I don't even have the materials. I can only do plus two then. So let's see what the damage is looking like now. 126 versus 106. Yep. We can now start using this one again. I could probably do with buying some new legs, because my legs kind of suck. You homeboy, you got legs. Radiance judgment. For a thousand, I could buy the Hollow Knight leggings, which are better than mine in every way. I don't think they'll make me too heavy. Our also, I picked up a new helmet, didn't redemption. I? Yeah, I got this pure blade helm. Good old bucket helm, dude. When did we get a cloak? Have we had this cloak for a while and I just haven't even been paying attention? Hadn't even noticed we had a cloak. <laughs> so I think I do have one of the things that'll give me like 200, right? Give me those hollowed legs, brother. Give me them legs. Judgment. Our Immaculate Lady will bring redemption. <laughs> Still medium roll. Hells yeah. You're looking mighty nice. The Mornstead Infantry continues. Hells yeah. Okay, we've upgraded. The only thing left to do is the, bo is, uh, the next two couple of bosses, but I'm going to take a break. We'll come back tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow, maybe on Monday. I need to spend some time with my kids at some point. As today I came in here and then just played this thing like a goddamn degenerate. But for now, that is going to be it. If you guys enjoyed today's stream, hopefully it was better than yesterday's, even though we did have more crashes today, I feel like. But, uh... Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, hit the like button, subscribe, bell notification icon, all that jazz. We'll be sure to have some more content of this game thrown at you in the near future. Love you all. Thank you for hanging out. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Stay strong. Stay safe. Peace out.